I'm Margaret Brennan in Washington, and this week on Face the Nation, with days to go before a government shutdown, Congress is paralyzed by infighting. The arsonists have lit their house on fire. They're whining about their house burning. Fiery words from top Republicans who worked through the weekend to find a way forward on funding the government before month's end. Will you work with Democrats? Look, uh, I believe we have a majority here, and we can work together to solve this. Can Republicans unify and strike a deal that also works for the Democratic-controlled Senate? We'll have the latest on negotiations. Then... Our immigration system is absolutely broken, and Congress needs to fix it. America's southern border is under strain once again, with migrant crossings on track to hit record highs. We'll ask Texas Republican Tony Gonzalez what he is seeing in his district and whether the issue could complicate spending negotiations on Capitol Hill. Plus... No justice! No peace! The labor protest targeting America's big three automakers expands as workers in 38 locations in 20 states go on strike. We'll hear this morning from Democratic Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, who's headed to Missouri later today to join a picket line. Arizona Democratic Senator Mark Kelly just got back from a trip to Ukraine. We'll ask him what he learned. Former Trump National Security Advisor Robert O'Brien will also join us. And finally, a conversation with the First Lady of Ukraine, Olena Zelenska, about the horrors of war and the hard work of healing. It's all just ahead on Face the Nation.